this case, there is a villain. The, the, the Houston Astros organization and their players like Jose Altuve, Tuve, 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 they, they are cheaters. If it turns out all of baseball is doing it, bad for baseball. But if we can pin it on a few clubs, a few bad apples, baseball can benefit from this. Well, In today's generation, in today's generation, in today's generation. That is not the case. This basketball is an option. This football is an option. This Hollywood is an option for crying out loud. This social media. You got a cute way of talking. You got. Hollywood is an option for crying out loud. This social media, you don't have to pay attention to baseball. You don't have to pay attention to baseball. You can turn away from it. You don't have to pay attention to baseball. You can turn away from it. You don't have to pay attention to baseball. You can turn away from it. Based off the sheer disgust.
I thought the apologies were whatever. Uh, I thought Jim Cranes was weak. Um, I thought Manfred's punishment was weak, giving him immunity. Um, I mean, these guys were cheating for three years. Cody, like, you don't know the facts. We're all in there, and nobody wants to talk about this, but I'm going to talk about this. Jose Altuve was the one guy that didn't use the trash can. The few times that the trash can was banged was without his concern, consent, and he would go inside the clubhouse, inside the dugout, to whoever was banging the trash can, and he will get pissed. He will get mad. When you look at Altuve's numbers on the road, he hit 400 on the road. He didn't see nobody of the MVP. He earned that MVP. For me to go out there and, and for him to go out there and defame um, Jose Altuve's name like that, like, it doesn't sit right with me. Because the man plays the game clean. And that's easy to find out, Ken. Mike Fires broke the story. You can go out and ask Mike Fires, did Jose Altuve use the trash can? Did Jose Altuve cheat to win the MVP? And Mike Fires is going to tell you straight up, he didn't use it. He was the one player that didn't use it. The reason Jose Altuve apologized to the media was for being part of the team and for not stopping it. But he's not apologizing for using the trash can. He's not apologizing for cheating because he did not cheat. And this is easy for you to find out, Ken. And he didn't cheat in 2017. And he didn't cheat in 2017. And he didn't cheat in 2017. And he didn't cheat. And he didn't cheat. And he didn't cheat. So when he talks about um, that we cheated for three years, I mean, he, is a, he either doesn't know how to read, he's really bad at reading comprehension, or he's just not informed at all. As far as cheating, Joe, everybody's been cheating for a long time. Well, you should have started a long time ago, because cheating's been going on forever. Uh, people have always cheated, but everybody's been cheating in sports for a long time, period. Um, you know, I think what people don't realize is Altuve stole an MVP from Judge in 17. Astros, you know, sometimes it just feels good to walk all over the Astros all day, just to squish them beneath my feet for an entire day. It just feels good. Something about it. Well, I guess they finally beat me. Six innings, uh, two runs, came on two homers. Altuve let off the game with a homer. Correa got fooled on a 2-0 cutter in the sixth and made a good adjustment, hit a homer. Um, six innings, 100 pitches. I wanted to go back out, but didn't get to, and then ended up uh, ended up giving up three in the seventh. So five-two loss.